What's good, YouTube? It's your boy Q the Flu, Q the Influencer. And yeah, we back with another one, baby. Let's get it, Flu Gang TV. Brainiac. Yo, so yeah, man. Today, you know, your boy just wanted to kind of check in, man. Kind of talk to you all a little bit about, you know, Supreme, Spring Summer 18, man, and where we at. I believe we are now, we just got past week 10 or 11. You know what I'm saying? So we winding down to those final weeks of the spring, summer uh, season. We still got some decent little items left over, man. I wanted to kind of check in, let y'all know what your boy Q the Flu has been copping. And then also, you know, kind of give y'all my thoughts. Man, uh, you know, what we got to look forward to the rest of the season, man. You know what I'm saying? So, let's get right into it. I hope y'all like the beginning. You know what I'm saying? Your boy did cop that Supreme, you know, Rawlins face mask out here, baby. This thing is pretty pretty dope you know what i'm saying as you can see here you know retail for about 130 dollars you know what i'm saying supreme is known for kind of dropping you know these random you know weird ass accessories uh throughout the course of the year man i just thought that this would be a dope one to kind of pick up um you know i could see you know halloween now you know a bunch of hype beats just kind of running around with this thing gone man the quality of this thing is actually pretty pretty nice man you got you know that plush you know rawlins you know pattern in there this does feel like genuine leather um and so the quality was just definitely spot on but what you expect it is rawlins uh dope piece man you know probably wear this around halloween man if i don't you know kind of get it out of here i know my boy nate triple og you know, his son, you know, kind of playing baseball, man. He definitely wanted to kind of, you know, be the, the dad and go out there and stun on him. You know, so he wanted to cop this, man. But, you know, y'all let me know in that comment box if y'all were able to cop this thing, man. You know what I'm saying? You know, pretty dope piece. Next thing over the last couple of weeks that I've been at, you know, I've been able to cop, you know, your boy did cop that Lacoste, you know, Supreme, you know, waist bag, and I'll take that thing out of there for you. You know what I'm saying? You already know how your boy Q the Flu feel about that Team Red game. So, you know, we had to cop the red leather Supreme Lacoste waistband, man. You know, the quality on this thing is superb. I think, you know, my favorite kind of detail about it is definitely like the band. You can see that DeVos Lacoste, you know, slash Supreme going around there. I thought that was definitely uh, dope. This is my first... Um, Supreme waist bag, you know what I'm saying? You know, kind of late to that. You know, I'm a big, you know, big boy gang. You know, we don't really, you know, I don't know what's really fitting around my waist, but you know, as you know, a few different ways to uh, rock this, man. So, you know, I definitely got that, you know, to show off. Had the cop Supreme to cost Supreme Summer 18. I know y'all seeing, I know y'all can see the drip, the MLK drip. Your boy, as I said in a couple of other videos, I had the cop the lemon mlk hooded sweatshirt man you know a lot of people kind of slept on these man you know uh you know i kind of heard a couple of my friends kind of talking about like you know it was you know they liked it they thought the hoodie was dope but you know they weren't really sure you know really how to rock that especially my homies from you know different you know hues and ethnicities man you know but i'm gonna say i mean mlk the goat you know how could you not you know, rock an MLK hoodie with pride, man. So if any of y'all were on the fence about copping this thing, man, go out there and cop it. It's a dope hoodie, man. You know what I'm saying? Like, you wear all type of other figures, you know. Don't think that you got, you got to be black to rock MLK, man. We can all rock MLK. He stood for something for all of us. You know what I'm saying? But let's get into it, man. You know, this, you know, in my opinion, this season thus far, it's just kind of been, you know, a little lackluster. Um... Not a lot of pieces that, you know, I've definitely been, um, that I've been excited about, you know, especially from the clothes standpoint. You know, I know we kind of like just over halfway in the season, um, and we should have a few, you know, probably a few more collabs left in the works that, you know, Supreme Ray, of course, haven't announced yet, um, that we should be getting excited about, but, you know, I don't know. It's just kind of been slow, man. Y'all let me know in that in that comment box, man, how y'all feeling about, you know, just, you know, the Supreme, you know, Spring Summer 18, you know, season thus far. You know, I know I got a few items that I'm still excited about and I'm looking forward to, like the radio, you know what I'm saying? Like, of course, that axe, you know, your boy definitely be trying to cop that, you know, on the clothes side. You know, I don't know. It ain't really a lot, you know, unless we get some really fire. I mean, there's always a chance some really fire collabs 
I'm definitely hopeful for. You know what I'm saying? Coming in the coming in, in the rest of the season. We still waiting on, you know, to hear, you know, about that Rick Rubin, you know, you know, the portrait, you know, T. Um, and what's gonna happen with that? But if not Rick Rubin, man, they gotta bless us with somebody. You know what I'm saying? And so, you know, just a few things, but you know, it's all good, man, because you know, when Supreme kind of slow like this, then we get us that's more, you know, time, effort, and energy. We can focus on all these fire sneaker drops that's been happening, you know what I'm saying, over the last couple of weeks. I mean, yo, Nike not letting up, you know what I'm saying? And we got some, you know, dope things coming up from Adidas too, man, you know, especially those, you know, black, you know, utility black five, Yeezy 500s. And I know right now Yeezy tripping out here. I don't know what's wrong with your mans. You know, I'm from Chicago, you know, Yeezy, you know, Kanye West is a special figure, you know, especially in Chicago lore. And, you know, I'm trying to hang in there. You know, I'm trying to hang in there. But, you know, he, right now, you know, my brother, he out here, he, he just tweaking. You know what I'm saying? I can't acknowledge that, you know. So, you know, as a Chicagoan, you know, we, we, we hold, we, we're trying to hold out hope that, you know, he can go ahead and, you know, be, you know, as great as he once was, man, and, like, fix this. Be hoping it's all one big bad dream. But, yeah. I'm no different than anybody else out here right now that just think your boy, yeah, you know, he off that special, you know what I'm saying? He, 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 he tweaking, he tweaking out here. That, that's just what it is. But, yeah, man, again, it's your boy Q Flu Kid Influencer. Y'all let me know in that comment box, man, you know, for the rest of the items that we got left, man. You know, what are we looking forward to? What are you looking forward to? You know, I want to hear about it in that comment box, you know what I'm saying? It's your boy Q the Flu. Kill the influencer. You already know how we rocking. Back at it with another quick one, baby. Gang, 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 gang. We out.